Here's our quiz in progress. We'll edit it and select the Questions tab. Let's add a new question. Fill in the blank. And it's about the campus. Here's the question. Now fill in the possible answers. Library, the official name, Library and Educational Technical Center, Tech Center, and Ed Tech Building. Let's add one more possible answer, Educational Technology Center, and update that question. The next question which is about learning styles, is a multiple fill-in-the-blank. It's worth four points. Here's the question. For each fill-in, you give an identifier with a number at the end in square brackets. The letter V in VARC is our first fill-in. We'll call it Style 1. A will be style 2, R will be style 3, and K will be style 4. We'll make those entries a bulleted list. Then select each fill-in and enter its correct answer. For style 1, the answer is visual. That's the only answer we want, and we'll delete this other possible answer. Style 2 could either be oral or auditory. The possible answers for Style 3 are reading, writing, read, write, or reading and writing. Style 4 has only one possible answer. Kinesthetic, get rid of the other possible answer, and update the question. The next question is about personality colors, and it's a matching question it's worth two points. Here's the question. Now we'll add our answers. On the left side, orange has these traits. Our next answer, gold, matches these traits. Green has this as its answer. And blue let's add one distractor. update the question. The last question, which is about goals, is an essay question worth three points. The question is, you don't enter a correct answer for an essay question. You have to grade those by hand. Again, update the question Always remember to do that, and we'll save and publish our quiz. And those are the major types of questions you will most often use in your Canvas quizzes.